the mayor checking in what is going on man this is the light life and the keys so exciting thousands down here check it out we're gonna go on a stroll and show you how we get down so uh enjoy please hit the subscribe button right over here Boop! hit all my social media platforms and check in with my man terry mutzler on production look how operational down here Thousand and thousand. Look, look who came out, Terry. Look who came out. Wow. Hey. Talk party. Wow. We keep it wild out here. Bush so, so the thing about Duval Street the is... Man in the bushes right there. There he is. Scaring people. Peek So the thing about Duval Street is when you pull up the Duval Street, you never know what you're gonna find. It's uh, very crazy, wild. Uh, it's about 10 at night right now, and we're just getting Something it started. A lot of people uh, acting wild around here, so uh, be careful, I don't want no accidents. But if you happen to get an accident, go to FloridaKeysInjury.com. Accident lures in the keys, they're gonna take care of y'all, and make sure you stay safe. But Terry looks like there's a lot of people on a Friday night, uh, we're getting ready for our Conor McGregor uh, fight tomorrow. It's going down, uh, Mojo's. So uh, we'll see uh, who's going to get knocked out. But let's check a, a little stroke. It's for Jazz. Yeah, all love straight out of Key West. Uh, thank y'all. Please hit the subscribe button. Woo, woo. Looks like some people getting some frozen drinks over here in the alley. Some jello shots. You know, that's how we do it. We, we spring breaking out here. They get turned up. It's a pregame. It's called the pregame. A lot of people out here. Look like, look, my man Joe Walsh going in right now. Caroline's. You want some good seafood? See my man right here. Caroline's full house right now, so so much love going on. We're getting ready also for Fantasy Fest. This is just a preview of what's going on. Go to Fantasy Fest Celebrity Parties on Facebook. Wow, they got a little party going on. Everything uh, is back to uh, normal here. Actually, uh, we're uh, pretty much sold out every weekend in Key West. If you're looking for a good uh, hotel room, I suggest the Barberry Beach House. That's right across the street, the Old Sheraton, right on uh, Smathers Beach. Uh, very lovely uh, property. And also, all the parties in the world, every party down here in the Keys, go to Where's the Party Key West on Facebook. Right now, we're entering the world-famous 200 block. Terry much long production. Here they come. Bring them out, bring them out, Terry. Bring them out, bring them out. So I'm glad to see new businesses open. So we got two new bars over here. Look like they're doing pretty good. Everybody drinks. Whole house here. What's the name of this place, Terry? Sticking Crawfish. Okay. Here we, we're approaching the Sloppy Joes over here. The world famous Irish Cabin. Let's see what they got going at the camp. We might pull up straight all the way on the top of the side. Both sides of the street are, are solid. Key West, Florida, baby. We do it big down here. The party will never stop. 
All love, please hit subscribe right here. Boop, boop. So we go uh, kick off tonight. It's just Friday. Tomorrow night is gonna be cray cray. Cray cray is cray. Look, it's hard even to talk out here, man. It's a lot of excitement. Man. We got we, we got the dog in the tent. That boy Mark Rossi, look, one time for the Key West uh, firefighters doing it, big. The firefighters riding big, city of Key West, doing it big. Terry almost gonna have to make an executive decision to shut the street down, man. It's going down. It is all the way lit right now. There's a pizza guy over there. Yeah. Angelina's Peaks, lovely situation. New business open there, new business alert. So some of y'all people, you know, staying in the office. See, like, this is how you do You could do this in Miami Beach. They just pull over right on the wall, right on the main strip. They just pull over. I think Ernest Hemingway uh, family checking in over here at the Sloppy Joe. My man out here slinging t-shirts, nothing but uh, merchandise. Merchandise is big. Give a shout out to uh, Hot Dog out here on the right. Come on. You want to go right or you want to just go straight? God bless the USA. Look, that girl uh, getting ready to get that Old Town Rodeo with the cowboy boots. Came on. Got yeah. sexy bull ride. It's all love. That's the old uh, Blake Feldman uh, green boot. Uh, new uh, bar came in town. So we're going to be right there. New dispensary. In case you need to get that medical weed right over here. All love. And this is going down to the 100 block. This is usually busier. Also, uh, Terry, I think we're pulling up on Monday, uh, official uh, Key West Hall, sorry, Key West City Hall uh, business with the uh, cruise ships. So yep. we'll see uh, where we at, because the governor said cruise ships are coming back. And uh, I don't know what Key West gonna do. Big Matthew, you on the live right now. Big Matthew selling jewelry right there, the number one jewelry person, there it is, doing it big. Thank y'all, all love. This is they don't they don't have these uh, spots on TripAdvisor. You got to just know uh, what's happening out here. So this is a uh, Front Street. This is uh, where it will be overloaded in the daytime with the cruise ship. This is a historic building right here. If you go on the right, you can hit Mallory Square. So we're gonna do the loop around and we're gonna pull up on on Captain Tony. I mean, Captain Tony ain't no joke. They still got the brick road over here. Terry, uh, that boy uh, Jay still got the store over here. Yep. That boy still slinging at this time. Shout out to the selfie king, Big J. There he is. Get you a little snack there. Number love right now. Number love. Hey. Um, right over here. Okay, so here's a little history about Key West. So the original Sloppy Joe's used to be right here, where is now Captain Tony. Before we get to that, this jewelry store, highly recommended by Louis C., the mayor's office on Greece. What's up, Pimpy? We on the live right now. I just want to give you a shout out, number one jewelry store. Hey, what's up, baby? All right. Man, we out here working, baby. What's the name of the business? Hey, Mind Shop Designs. Yes, sir. 24 Green Street, baby. We work late for you guys. Okay, see, it's all love, guy. I don't know what y'all do with another uh, city, so. Right here, see, playing that group. You got a court to turn? No. I'm going to get out the car and try to see. I know a guy that can do it right away. Really? Yeah. Got the truck. So look at Captain Tony. Shall we? This is the perfect situation. Look at that band playing in the back. This is Joe right here. How are you fabulous people doing today? I don't know. This is the only one. Big Joe, how you doing, bud? <laughs> Joe, how you doing, Bubba? Louis C. Rock, friend of the program. How have you been, sir? Good. I'm just giving you a little PR. We're doing a little uh, promotional work for the show. Everything lovely. How's the business? Put it on that man. It's a as list. long as I break even, I'm a happy man. Right. You're doing more than That's breaking all. even. That's all. Yeah. So how you been? What's new? Uh, I'm over there at the Old Town Road. You're trying to catch up with you. How's How's your boy Joe Weed doing? Joe Weed. Uh, Joe yesterday. I'm associated with, but that's his man. I see. I see him yesterday. <laughs> Oh, that's right. 
Yeah. You're the dude with the fucking airplane, the, the yeah. drones yeah, and yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's great. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. That's not, what, what, when are you going to bring the drones out? Uh, not anytime soon. Why? We'll, we'll, we lost one in the woods. What woods? There's no woods. Up over the jumping bridge. Joey, on um, Monday, I guess they're having a meeting at City Hall uh, referencing cruise ships. I don't know if you heard about it. They can't do anything about it. Yeah, well, me and you, we're on the same page, but they're having a meeting over. I'm just letting you know. They can have all the meetings they want. I already spoke to, to uh, Terry about six months ago about it. She said, I'm going to fight it as tooth and nail. I said, Terry, you can fight it all you want. Right. The reality is the governor's a lot stronger than you are. Yeah. So you, you got nowhere to go with this. All you have to do is acquiesce and make it work for the community. It's Absolutely. what's best for the community, Terry, not what's best for yeah. Terry. Absolutely. You know, in a, in a handful of other people that like to bitch and moan about plastic straws. I said to her, <laughs> I said, look, I said, look, why don't you do something for the city of Key West, okay? I said, pressure wash the sidewalks every Sunday, yeah. okay? Pressure wash the sidewalk every Sunday. Don't worry about plastic straws because they're not going to kill any manatees. I don't see that going on out there. And fill the fucking potholes in this town. I said... You know, it knocks out my alignment. Everywhere, you can, can you drive down Eaton Street without hitting a pothole every 10 feet? No, no. No, but she's more worried about plastic straws than she is about what's going on in the community. No, I want to appreciate, uh, I want to tell you, I appreciate when you came to all the meetings and stuff. I think we did, we really gave her help. We had to. There was no other choice. You have to. Yeah. I mean, it's ridiculous. And I mean, and look, here's the reality of it. And I told her this. I said, you look at places like... Amelia Island, Fernandina Beach, St. Augustine. The downtown area is not only spick and span, but all the trees are consistently trimmed. Right. They're nice royal palms. Look at these shit trees they give us. Yeah. And, they, and on top of it, they don't even <laughs> look at that. They don't even trim them. Yeah, is anything consistent? The There's nothing consistent. That's a different style than that one. They're yeah. all different. I mean, there's nothing consistent. When was the last time you saw the street sweeper out here? They don't come out. They don't clean the time, anything. The, time they, the last time they swept was on New Year's Eve. They yeah, had a street you know, sweeper. Look, it's a, <laughs> no, but you're right. Look, it's a tourist town. Yeah, right. This is how we make our money. Right. People come here. They want to see beauty. They want to see neat and clean. Yeah. There's some beauties right here. Fucking oh, yeah. vomit and piss. Yeah. yeah. Joey, thank you, Bubba. Thank you. Uh, Louie, I'm ranting and raving, but the reality of it is this. We live and die by the tourist industry, period. And if we can't make this place look presentable to them, our, our days are numbered. Absolutely. You know why? Because there's other towns out there that will. That work for it. Absolutely. That will. Yes, sir. Thank you, Joey. Are you around for a bit? Yeah, I'm going. All right, bud. I'll see you in a bit. What do you think about that? Well, I think uh, I love that man. That man's got a lot of passion. You know, this is like, when you see the trolley at 1030, there's a trolley, is that the trolley? Yeah. Uh, shout out to Ed Swift, that man caught a whole bunch of hell too, out there, they, they tried to kill that man. You know, the reality is, um, there's a gentleman named Ed Swift, he figured it out, he started with a print shop in Marathon, and he built a million dollar uh, business uh, all over the world, and some people are uh, locally uh, envious of that man but that man uh, doing his thing that's all I can tell you world famous sloppy Joe's we're back at it so all up what would you think Terry would get a little bit more panic down uh, and make it happen it looked like Terry I, I haven't seen the streets like this it wasn't like this this last week and, and let me tell y'all this the crowd coming through here this is after the July 4th weekend. Right. Terry, correct me if I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong, but this looks busy. way more busier than it looked on the July 4th weekend. You know, I think a lot of it has to do with that storm. People stayed longer because of the fact that some of the planes were right. canceled right. and came in a couple days later. But I mean, this is pretty busy. Yeah. They're trying to peak game out here. They're trying to hustle over here, trying to make it up. There they go, hustling for a dollar. So, Louis C. the mayor, um, Shout out to the Old Town Rodeo, 618 Duval Street, world famous sexy bull riding. And uh, it's all love. You got to get out here, like I said, on the streets and see what's going on. The next one, we're going to walk and shake hands and kiss babies. So this is it right here. So I'm trying to give y'all a live feel for those of y'all can't be with us on what's really going on down here 
down. They got an earful today. Ooh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Joy, Joy didn't say you, you heard what that man said. He said, <laughs> yeah. he said the, the governor is way more powerful than mayor. He's right about that. He's always been there for us. He's been there for a long time. He about that from Tony. Tony was the mayor, so he knows. Huh? Tony was the mayor, so he knows. No, no, I'm talking about the gentleman we just spoke to. Yeah, he's been there for a while. Yeah. He, that man's very uh, passionate. So look, these golf carts are, are good. Y'all riding big. Look at y'all. Y'all riding big. Look, y'all on the live right now on the YouTube. Where y'all from? Welcome to the Keys. Come do sexy bull riding down on 600 block Old Town Rodeo. There you go. This is PR, public relations, promotion. The scooter. The bus. Hey, y'all live right now on the cam. Where y'all from? Uh, San Diego. Welcome to Key West. Everybody give you a prop. You tell them Louis C. the mayor got your back. You see San Diego, Oklahoma. This is how we do it. Now, if y'all get out of that office and you find out what's going on, see, how far, how fast are we going, Terry? Two miles an hour. You eat that, right? Two. Right there, you hear a horn? Look, they turned up pregame. What they got? Rock them out? Oh, yeah, that guy always does that. Oh, that's another thing. He does that. He you know, does. He, another thing here. Terry. He gives away vodka. Terry, let me ask you a question. Well, look, look at him. Look he at does. Him. He gives away vodka. He does? Yeah. That's how I'm going do it? Yeah. Right next to the, yeah. Wow. I hung out with that man a bunch of times. Well, I, I don't believe people are going to turn away. Uh, no, they're not. I don't think it's going to happen. I got to tell you, the action is uh, big, extreme. So, so we pretty much uh, covered the street here, and uh, we're going to go up to uh, the 600 block, and then we're going to do what we need to do. I think we're scared you, I need to talk to Bushman, too. Bushman, mm -hmm. I talked to him yesterday. La Concha over here? That man stole a mannequin right there. Oh, there he is. No, it's not a mannequin. Still, I stole a mannequin before. We'll get into that some other time. <laughs> so, yep, as y'all can see, it's live, it's lit, it's wild. Definitely 200 block is off the chamber. So, hit me on my uh, YouTube, subscribe right over here. Boop, we're going to keep it uh, all the way lit. St. Carlos, shout out to all my people in Cuba uh, watching on the YouTube. All love right now. World famous Australian theater. We only show you up. Now we got tables on the sidewalk. We're gonna get a pan. I don't like when they when they sit on the sidewalk. Who we got playing there, Ted? Let's see, uh, let's see, I can't see that far. Is that Jack Wolf? That's Jack Motherfucking Wolf. That's what they call him. Yeah, this is, that's a dancing man. Right there. That man, has, he ends up going home with girls all night long. That's his thing. Everybody got to have their thing, right, Terry? Yeah. Everybody got to have their he thing. He figured it out. That man figured out. I dance. You know, you know that man make about $302. Yeah. And he brings home girls. Yeah, that man. That man a hustle. So all love. Dancing Dan, I think. I, so the thing, uh, and Terry will tell you this. Uh, if you go on the streets and you don't go out there for two weeks, you'll definitely miss some thing that just popped up. On, the, on Duval Street, so. Over here, they're doing a little hookah. They got a little alley right there. Yeah. Yeah. Down the alley is the hookah, the 600. It's pretty good. Got the cigars right there. Look, there's a hookah doing their can. Sneak attack. Old Town Rodeo. Gotta keep them on their toes. Gotta keep them on their toes. Scooter parking. Killed it today. Of course, now you hear Tomorrow we're gonna show the McGregor fight right here. Take get a little pin. So, uh, Louis C. the mayor. Terry, I think we've done all we could do over here. Thank you for the production. Thank you for the love. And I'm having I'm been really good spirits. Look that, that girl's on the report. 
We got you on the news, girl. We got you. Yeah, see, we the noodle place. Noodle. Oh yeah, that's a nice little spot there. Six on it. All love right here. So, have a good night. Please hit the subscribe button. Somebody out cold here. Cold. That's like me. Cold. We'll end it on that. Twenty-four minutes.